Welcome back to Let's Play Knights of the Old Republic. I'm Hunter Black Luna, and we were just going to proceed to explore Upper City North. And yes, the game will continually remind us of that whole level up thing. Ah, what a view. That even looks good by... Well, I don't know by today's standards, but it looks good, period. Alright, that's to an apartment complex. Uh, kind of like the one we woke up in. We can check that out later. But maybe... No, let's do it now. Actually, that would make more sense. Man, I can't wait till four speed. Use it to speed up just the random running around that we do. I don't think we'll get into many fights up here, though. You ever seen a swoop bike? I've seen them at the races sometimes. They go fast and make lots of noise. Yep. Ready. Probably a swoop bike. On it. Dum -dum. It's open. Hey, you want to have a little morality lesson about the whole RPG stealing everything? I remember when a person didn't have to worry about thieves rummaging through their home. Don't. Don't hurt my family. Look, just take what you want and get out. There. Feel at least a little guilty? I sort of yeah. do. Not enough to stop, but hey. This is for the good of the galaxy, and they just don't understand that. Ooh, it's the party. Hey, you made it. I was beginning to wonder if you were going to show. The party's in full swing. Come on in. You have to try this Teresian ale. It's fantastic. We should have conquered this planet ages ago. Careful, Sana. That wine's got quite the kick. A couple more bottles and we'll all be passed out on the floor. Who cares? We're not on duty tomorrow. Let's live a little. Come on, drink up. Huh. Oh, I probably should mention this whole sequence is from a little mod, too. See, if you're a guy, you can, uh chat up the Sith lady and, you know, convince her to invite you to a party, and what's supposed to happen is fade to black and everyone's collapsed drunk, and then you steal the... Sith uniforms from them. Hmm. But instead we got a pass card for the Sith base. Very weird. Oh well, we get the Sith armor anyway. Yeah. Well, obviously it's not an option for the woman to chat up and flirt up the Sith. But they took it anyway because of the mod. Which is basically a mod that gives you um, equal opportunity. But there's some bugs to be worked out. That pass card might enable us to, like, skip the game. In fact, that might even be a feature, or at least uh, skip Terrace, but I'm not going to use it, and we are going to pretend that it doesn't exist. All that we got out of that party was a Sith uniform. Which will come in handy, um, shortly. Taurus used to be a nice place before the Sith showed up and started bossing us around. Uh, the way I hear it from people, it was always kinda crap. The planet's been in decline for a while. Man, so many useful items up here. I heard the gangs have overrun the lower city. Why don't the Sith go down there and restore? Because the Sith don't care. Ready. People don't seem to grasp that. I'm so glad the mod didn't mess On things it. up though. It's open. Like make it impossible to advance. What? Or somewhere else. Please, please don't hurt me. You don't have to kill me. I'll have Davik's money if he if he just gives me a little more time. Please, I don't want to die. Here, I've got 50 credits on me. That's all I've got. It's yours. Just don't tell Davik where I'm hiding, okay? I'm begging you. That's kind of a... Uh, maybe you should give the 50 credits to Davik as a down payment. Well, that didn't really work well with the old man. 
You mean, you're not here to kill me? But I, I thought you were one of Davik's bounty hunters. You do kind of look the part. If you're not here to kill me, what do you want? I don't think anyone can help me. I owe Davik money, and I was late with the payment. So he went to Zach's in the bounty office and put a price on my head. I've been hiding here ever since. But sooner or later, someone will find me. Unless I somehow come up with another 200 credits. I'm a dead man. Oof. That's quite a woofer, man. Or I can kill you. Oh, I'll take the neutral option. Fine, I'm a good person. You'd give 200 credits to a stranger just to help them out? <laughs> I don't believe it. Well, uh, thank you. Wow, that sure was generous of you. I just hope we don't end up needing those credits later on. Me too. Now I can pay off Davik. Oh, thank you. You've saved my life. Oh, I better go give this to Davik right away. And we've moved closer to the light side of the force. You can see we already got the blue glow and everything. Soon we'll be as morally good as Karth. Let's just go steal his stuff. Three credits, not really worth it. I suppose we could sell the repair part in the computer spike, and actually the amount of money we would get is just about similar. Do we have the whole place? Alright, we have the whole place. Good job, everybody. Got ourselves a Sith uniform. Yeah. Let's see here. Sith armor. There. Now, no one can tell the difference. Except for the fact that we've got a person who's obviously with the Republic tailing us, but hey. By the way, you'll actually get different reactions out of people if you wear this uniform, obviously. Ooh, hey, look at this! It's the shift! Oh no! I'm so scared! <laughs> Careful. Don't do anything stupid. We don't have no trouble with the Sith. Oh yeah, you're right. <laughs> Sorry about this, Shithy. <laughs> Come on, fellas, let's go. I think otherwise these idiots end up picking a fight or something. It's just simpler all around if you use a little bit of the intimidation. A plague spreads through our streets. We cannot sit idly by while this pox infects our society. Guess who he's talking about, everybody. Greetings, my Sith friends. Rest assured, I have all the proper permits to be here, spreading my message. Feel free to stay and listen if you wish. You'll find my message most enlightening. Oh, uh, yeah? That makes me... slightly curious. Friends and fellow humans, I'd bring you a warning. A warning of a great plague spreading across our planet. Please, Listen to me. My name is Gorton Kolu. Will you join my cause? We must band together if we are to stop the spread of vermin and scum throughout Taris. Have you figured it out yet? I am speaking of the hideous-looking aliens who walk the world of Taris. The Wookiees and Ithorians and Rodians and Bith, all of them. Listen, friend, for these are dark times. That is why I, Gorton Kolu, have formed the Anti-Alien League. The time has come for action. We cannot sit idly by while aliens blight our glorious planet! You're right. <laughs> Man. No, fuck off. You are like all the rest. You will not see the truth. On the day of reckoning, you will suffer with the rest of the alien lovers. Come on, we should keep moving. Cook or no, people like him can make trouble for us. The only trouble here is whatever. Listen to me, people. That is a terrible... There's a droid shop here. We don't have any droids, so... I'm not terribly interested. The evil walks among us. The enemy is here. We must... I wish you could intimidate that guy with a Sith uniform into shutting up. The Sith base is over there, as you can see. Getting in there triggers, like, you can get off the planet. Or at least that's one of the main 
things. I'm not sure if it breaks the game if I were to use that pass card or whatever. As I said, it doesn't exist. There's no option to throw items away, I think, so... This elevator is off limits. Only Sith patrols and those with proper authorization are allowed into the lower All city. Right. It's obvious from the way you're dressed that you're not one of the Sith patrols. So unless you have the authorization papers, you must move along. Alright. Move along, then. We're gonna need some kind of disguise if we want to get past this guy. No worries about that. Well, bam. Change right in front of him. And... Another patrol heading down to the lower city, eh? Well, good luck. I've heard it's pretty rough down there. There's a big swoop gang war going on, you know. You better watch yourself. Those gangs will take a shot at anyone, even us. It's too bad we don't have the manpower just to sweep those slums clean. Well, apparently, short-term memory is linked to firing accuracy or something because, man... And down into the slums. Let's look at these armor stats. Defense bonus of 2, max dexterity of 8. That's not bad if you're a rogue or something. It's kinda eh. Man, it's like Stormtrooper armor. It barely protects more than just running around in like a t-shirt and jeans. That's kinda sad. gonna be a rumble tonight. Kaba dumpa kunpa ye ya moka pata. Wana night kachu. Yin kin kuno ba muli rachi kun. Tong na bun shan yun yang. Kaba wol pa mulchi kamana. Ichuta. Yun patisa. Yin ba ni chalora kun. Guess who's the good guys and who's the bad just based on the results of the fighting. Just guess. Kipona Kava Tumpa Kupa Yiya Moka Pata Chiyoka. That's a lot to say more strangers. Ah, um, guess we missed. Oh, Looks like these guys ain't exactly difficult, however. Yeah, the black, the black cultures are gonna be plaguing you for a while. They're the bad guy gang, whereas the hidden becks are the good guy gang. And we'll be meeting both of them eventually. Let's see, drop any remains? Drop any remains? No, no. All right, the black Volker base is like right there, as I recall. Medpacks. Yeah, Volker Guards. I wasted a frag grenade on you douchebags. Charge! I wouldn't recommend actually going in the base right now. I'm not even sure if it's possible. I don't want to try. Alright. Time to revel up. Okay. Treat injury, definitely. Pump up Persuade, another point. That's good, that's good. Uh, awareness. It's all about incremental increasing. Increasing the stats, yeah. And we get another feat. I don't know. Maybe toughness would be good. That would bring us up to 10 hit points per level. I know I'm not up for dueling. Repair, security, and computer use. That would allow us to try security too, but I don't know. Um, I think... Yeah, toughness. Because on our next level up, we'll get the next tier. So toughness is good. Get us lots of vitality points. Certainly enough to take care of these jokers. Especially if they get distracted with the little shooting them up. I guess it was nice to kill them. 
There'll be tons of Volkers trying to get at you. Anyway, the reason we were here. Looting corpses. Oh, looks like we already got it. And there's remains. No clue how I missed that or if it just took forever for it to spawn. Shock stick is... yeah, it's bad. But it can stun people. And here's another apartment complex. It's more dangerous. There's Volkers wandering around. And, you know, undesirable types that need to be cleared out. We can also repair the sentry droid and get it to do some business. Alright, yeah, we can get the droid functioning. Order it to patrol. I probably won't spend parts on these other things. I've already spent enough parts here. There we go, 60 EXPs. Plus, it'll go kill the Volkers for us and it'll help us out in fighting. Perfect grenade situation, but we have the droid here, so I'm not gonna bother. These guys are difficult, but it's nice to have it around. Some of these apartments are just full of Volkers. Like this one. Oh, use a little more fire support. And however, however an enemy dies, you get the EXPs, as far as I'm aware. That's good. You're getting a lot of critical bits. Forgot to, forgot to check this one. Ah, oh, just the one Volker. Hundred EXP every time we do that. No remains from the guy. Ho oh ho! Enemies! That's... Oh, I thought he was inside for some reason. I don't know why. Oh, another level up already. Oh, it actually opens doors? This guy might be a little tough. Oh, apparently not. I thought that frag grenade was... Well, he is the gang boss. And his shields are reflecting... ...all kinds of BS. Oh. 350. Not bad. Concussion grenades. I'll probably chuck them just to use them. I tend to let things like mines and grenades really accumulate and just never use them, and that's. It's a bad habit if you just never use vital tools. Eventually, you'll get to the end of the game with them still hoarded, and. Eh. That sentry droid's about dead, yeah, it's kind of got a low life expectancy. Alright, Karth, how about instead of a blaster pistol, you pick up a heavy blaster? Yep, and it still counts as balanced. Which means it doesn't throw off the two-weapon fighting deal. I can put Karth into Sith armor, and I'm pretty sure he wouldn't mind, which is kind of funny. Switch back to me. I'll put the energy shield on my arm just in case I need it at some point. Ooh, this place. Let's come back to this place after we've done the fighting. Man, it's like limping in the air or something. Yep, can't reprogram the droid either. Well, we got a bit of use out of it. Probably not enough, given the experience points involved. Ready. He's gonna check something. That's Matrix apartment. There's two apartments in here that are different than the others and have, like, people in them you can talk to. 
on it. Matrix is one. It's open. Kipuna. Kavatumpa kupa yiya moka paata. Like that ever stopped us before. Kutumpa. Chibedwana ni bobo. Apple persuade skill. We eat a nadana yiya. Really? Kipuna. Do I have to have me selected? Ajuta. We eat. Really? Keep I don't have persuade skill enough. What the hell? All right. I have an effective persuade of six. Like I said, we don't get feedback specifically about a failure of persuasion. Alright, we'll just take your stuff and come back when we can talk to you, I suppose. Ajuta. Oh, hey, it worked. Tonghai to Amji, you malifpa, Ninkotu. Tolba da bunk, Walia Gando, the Nago Chuchut, Kachi Chu Aitha Haudunga. You malifka in Kotun, Chilo Mulra de Nebobo, Unka Kun Biskang, Bamulara, Takum Justak Miki Gravel Mogo. Kachi Chu Aitha Haudunga, Tolba da bunk, Walia Gando, the Nago Chuchut. Moga shampoopa, bola wana chikni, bamul slick mo poda na wanga. Is muli ra best, kachi chuai sa hodunga. In king kuno bamuli ra chikun. Slim apo dona, rundi hodunga. Maybe I can help you. We ita na dana ita. What are you makawa ma huha nek? A shunk turong umnipatoga. Wana kun best ching. Have Damik eliminated. I don't know, he's the crime lord of the whole planet. Uh Davik probably wouldn't take a bribe because he's rich already. We Itha Nadana Yitya Kunti Chani Tongba Toga Smaktelia Takum Justak Miki Gravel Mogo. Kachi chu ai thao donga, tulpa da bonk molya gando da nago chuchut. Mana mana tota, aku chikratuk pola, jishok chonatong chung king no una pa, wata wama mulira, king kuncho peshak. No ba mulira. Like what we bought in the upper city for no reason, but it turned out to have a reason. Oh yeah. Tonghai tuam jiji yu malith pa ang ninko tu. I've got a permacreed de- Achuta! Wanga kun. Shag ji kin lor cha wata uma. By the way, make sure you leave the chest before you set it off, cause... As soon as you tell me I have the detonator, then he blows it. Kin kun no ba muli ra ji kun? As such. Careful, man. That blade is pretty sharp. Tony Pudu. Rana no prata don't know. Sarcha. Mucha shag pangpa. Inkin kun no ba mulri. Rachi kun. Takum justak miki gravel mogo. Kachi chu ai thao donga, tulpa da bonk molya gando da nago chuchut. No problem. Moga shampong, tong hai tuam jiji yu malith pa ang niko tu. Look with your new life, man. Tulpa da bonk molya gando da nago chuchut. Kachi chu ai thao. Side points, a lot of EXPs. And we can go collect the bounty when we feel like it. Oh, Karth looks like he wants to talk to us. Yes, what's on your mind? I'm all ears, beautiful. Ha! Huh. Why do I get the impression you're not serious? 
Maybe I'm just avoiding your questions. Is this really necessary? If you have a problem with it. No, no, I don't have a problem with it, really. Go ahead and interrogate me. All my secrets are purely of the mundane variety, unfortunately. Nothing worth extracting, though you're welcome to try. Let me ask you something first, though. I've been going through the battle aboard the Endar Spire over and over in my head since we crashed. Some things just don't add up for me. Maybe you could tell me what happened. That sounded a little accusatory. True. Bastila is as powerful as I say. She's the one who defeated Darth Revan, after all. Mm. I guess that no Jedi ability, no matter how powerful, makes up for being completely surprised and outmatched. We didn't choose that battle anyway. It got forced on us. Hell, I'm, I'm, I'm just as surprised that any of us are alive to talk about it. Come to think of it, it's more than a little surprising that you happen to be here, isn't it? I mean, just what is your position with the Republic fleet anyway? Why? Not at all. I just think it's a bit odd that someone who got added to the crew roster at the last minute just happens to be one of the survivors. Why would you say that? You were the only one. Not to mention that Bastila's party was the one who requested your transfer. The Jedi requested numerous things when they came on board. I mean, hell, they practically took over the ship, as far as I could tell. Considering your connection to Bastila and the Jedi, whether you know it or not, your presence here seems a little convenient. I'm probably wrong. Yeah. And this is probably nothing, I know. I learned a long time ago not to take things at face value, however, and I hate I'm surprises. emotionally guarded because of my past. I mean, I have to expect the unexpected, just to be safe. Look, it has nothing to do with you personally. I don't trust anyone, and I have my reasons. And no, I'm not going to discuss them, so can we just keep our mind right. on more important things? All right, all right. You must be the most... We'll talk about it, but later. Right now, I just want to get going. Me too. I can understand some passive aggressiveness sometimes. Man. Hang on a second. Was I wrong about something special being here? Guess I was. I said I'd save that. Well, where was the one? That was one we came across that was different than the others, and I said I'd save it for later. Whoa, whoa. Man. Do we make sure to pick these clean? I forget. Uh, I got a little distracted by being annoyed. Also, all the apartments tend to blend together just a little bit. No, I wasn't wrong. Puzzle time, everybody. Also, time to save the game. Just because I like saving the game. It's important to uh, protect your data. Here's a data pad about the Twisted Rancor Trio. I think we should read this before we try this puzzle, guys. Let's have us a read. New items. The Twisted Rancor Trio. Man, I have all this screen real estate and I really can't fit any more text without having a scroll box. Alright, the first name that's important here is Elinda. Elinda, Uja, and Uji. Elinda, Uja, Uji. So... Elinda. Then we find Uja. Not Lupa. Uja and Uji. Hope you see how this puzzle goes by now, guys. I really do. Uja and Uji. Lupa. Photo.
Ashana. Luba. Photo. Ashana. And the security system deactivates. By the way, if you do this puzzle wrong twice, it blows up. Shiny fiber armor and 50 bucks. Alright. Guess who's getting the new armor, everybody? Here's a hint. It's not Karth. Although, Karth, I suppose you can have the combat suit now. There, now we're a little less conspicuously Republican. I'm here. Alright, looks like that was it. Let's get out of here. Guess we're going this way. We can explore the rest of the lower city. Not the undercity. Undercity is uh, lower than that. Javier's Cantina. Hive of Scum and Villainy. There's the hidden Beck base. We'll go see about that later. There's some Black Volkers. I'm gonna save my last frag grenade to see if I can actually use it usefully instead of just wasting it like usual. Even though I don't know, three of them at once. Would be good business. Man, he just got tore up. It's interesting how sometimes they aggro to him. But if the two of us work together on this enforcer, then he's. He's not much of a problem. Any loot from the four of them? Any loot at all? Okay. You guys are behind with your payments. What do you, uh, you think just because you're in some gang, you don't have to give Davik his cut? Ah, so you want to play this the hard way. <laughs> okay. Tony Pudu! Rana no prata don't know, Sarcha! It's you a penki! What on our mamulira? Can't you do a shark? No bully muli raji, Johnny Tun, Turji Chiwi Itado, Bola una dichek, Balamuri Slimo Wanga Kundi. These guys do go on. I knew you boys would see reason. Now get out of here. Too bad. I was looking forward to cracking some heads. Maybe next time, Candrus. I better get this over to Davik. I'll call you if anyone else gets behind on their payments. Ooh, this person looks important. Those Valkers are dumber than a chorus and granite slug. They actually think being in that pathetic little gang of theirs makes them important. Gadon keeps his hidden becks in line, but Brezik's getting dreams of grandeur. If Davik's smart, he'll slap that young punk back down. Okay, I'll be going. Now. I don't have time to stick around here anyway. Davik's. Sorry for the sudden cut. It's cutting in and out, you know. Life stuff happens sometimes. Chiwi aita ka tong chicha, agi inko tune kuna muri ra tangi wama jiko na tong ipa nongku nek abog kio kaku kimba muri ra tuana ji. Kuyami juski chika nai uba baska duana chichopa muska jiska da soki kupa bona na tachu. There's a bounty on your little green heads. I'm here to collect. Just kronki to pets nemo chi ita kanki chana kilikon kimba muli. That's the plan. <laughs> Oh, 
I'm sure he'll be important later too. Uh, this is about as good a place to stop as any. Next time on Nice the Old Republic, we'll clear this apartment. Maybe check out the cantina.